In a shocking expose, The Hollywood Reporter has released a critical article that paints Meghan Markle in an unflattering light, portraying her as a bullying figure who fosters a toxic work environment. Staff turnover within her and Prince Harry's circle has reached alarming levels, with numerous employees reportedly leaving due to Meghan's alleged abusive behavior. Described as a dictator in high heels, Markle is accused of belittling her team, creating a pervasive culture of fear that has left many feeling devalued and voiceless. The article raises serious questions about Prince Harry's role in this troubling dynamic. While he may be charming, he has reportedly failed to support his staff when they voice their concerns about Meghan's treatment. This complicity has drawn criticism, as it suggests a willingness to overlook troubling behavior in favor of maintaining a harmonious facade, further entrenching the toxic atmosphere. As the mainstream media picks up on these claims, including outlets like Access Hollywood, a narrative is forming that challenges the carefully curated image of Meghan as a victim. This shift in public perception is significant, especially in light of her previous portrayal as someone oppressed by royal courtiers. The criticisms, echoed by former royal aides, indicate a persistent pattern in Markle's professional relationships, hinting at deeper issues that go beyond mere misunderstandings. Compounding this situation is the secrecy surrounding her former staff, many of whom are bound by non-disclosure agreements. These legal restrictions mean they cannot speak openly about their experiences, making their off-the-record comments even more poignant. It raises the question, what are they so afraid to disclose? The silence imposed by NDAs speaks volumes about the environment Meghan has fostered, making their whispers of discontent resonate powerfully amidst the clamor of public opinion. This unfolding narrative not only highlights Meghan's alleged misdeeds, but also challenges the broader discourse surrounding celebrity and power dynamics. The stark contrast between her public persona and the chilling accounts from former staff could shift the tides of public sympathy, leaving many to wonder about the true nature of the Duchess. With historical parallels drawn to past criticisms from royal courtiers, this situation may not be an isolated incident, but rather indicative of a larger, systemic issue. As the media continues to delve into these accusations, the ultimate question remains, how much longer can the facade hold against the mounting evidence of a toxic work environment? Meghan Markle's story is far from over, and with each revelation, the stakes only grow higher.